Well, hey guys, how you doing? I'm doing great. Hope you're doing good too. I have a video for you guys. <laughs> so today, if you couldn't tell from the title, I'm doing a... Oh god, this is heavy. A what's in my backpack video! Sometimes backpacks are way more boss than purses. They carry way more stuff that you don't really need, but you want to carry around anyways. And I actually use this as my travel bag. So everything that I consider an airport necessity is in this bag, as well as a travel necessity. I don't know if you guys follow me on Twitter. If you don't, ArdenRose186. Follow it. Love it. Favorite it, retweet it, do that. But on Twitter, I told you guys that I lost my luggage at the airport. They like just didn't get it. I guess I don't. I don't know how that happens. Like, how does that physically? Like, uh. Either way, I lost it, right? And I was only left with this backpack, and I survived. So, without further ado, let's get into my backpack. Woo! First things first. You may ask yourself, Arden, where did you get that fantastic backpack? Let me tell you, dear friend, this is from Nordstrom, uh, specifically the brand called Herschel. And if you haven't seen these backpacks before, where have you been? Do you live under a rock? Question mark. No, I'm kidding. They're like fairly popular now. I don't know if it's just in California or everywhere. It has like a little stripey interior. Is this properly showing it in my gorgeous ponytail that's decided to split. What am I, Bam Bam? So let's open up this drawstring and get started. First things first, it has a laptop case in which my laptop sits. Oh yeah, if you're wondering what kind of laptop I have, it is the MacBook Pro Retina display. Look how sassy. Because I think it'd be really awesome, I'm gonna show you guys what my background is on my laptop. Yes, Zach Galifianakis in a bathtub with actual duckies, naked. The duckies aren't naked, he's naked, which is even creepier. At least it's not him in a swimsuit. So moving on from my laptop, uh, I also have notebooks in the laptop pocket because I like to carry around moleskin notebooks. They're awesome, the paper is just fantabulous. I write down all of my ideas, anything related to like videos I wanna do, ideas I have, all that kind of stuff. I write down in here, brainstorm, and then come back to it later, probably to never see it again. Because once I write things down, I never really look at them again. Don't know if that's everyone, probably just me. Next thing in the backpack is this shirt. The reasoning behind this is that when I travel, I either get extremely hot or extremely cold in the airplane. So what I tend to do is wear relatively warm uh, weather clothes into the airport, and then the moment that I find out it's frigid, I throw this bad boy on. This is a night shirt by Ralph Lauren, but what I do is I take it and I like roll up the sleeves on it so it's like all cropped, and then I also tie little knots in the sides. So it's not really like a dress shirt anymore, it's like a cover up over jacket. So it's just like the perfect little blanket to snuggle up in. Advice from Arden, steal your dad's shirts. Next up I have my headphones. These are uh, Urban Ears. I seriously need to get a new pair of these. It was so long ago that I bought these. Uh, they're like disgusting. So brown around the edges, like way too much dry shampoo was used in the making of this movie. One of the buds doesn't really work that well and then the button is also broken. So. I think it's time to make an upgrade. I actually really loved my Urban Ears while they were still surviving. I'm still using them. I'm gonna use them until they literally fart on my ears. Like, fart out, electrocute me, I die, my Urban Ears die. And then I'll buy a new pair in heaven. So there you go. In my backpack, I also have my toothbrush and my toothpaste because like I said, I never know if my luggage is gonna make it to the city where I would like everything to be. So I like to carry necessities like teeth brushing utensils so that just in case I get stranded somewhere, when I'm asking for directions, the person won't die from my bad breath. I will have freshly cleaned teeth. Next up, I have my gaming mic. This is what I use to just like play video games on the go. Like nothing important or anything. It's just like ergonomic to my hand and it feels nice. Next up, I have my iPad. Do, 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 do. It has like coffee time on the back. That's the case. Thought you guys might want to see it. The actual background is also Adventure Time. And then the background is Winnie the Pooh. Because I really like this little quote. It's just super duper cute. Like I said in my last video, I've been obsessed with Agatha Christie. And so I have her book Murder on the Orient Express. 
and I've been reading that. I'm only 17 pages in, but I'm super stoked to read it. And that's normally what I do on airplanes. Like when I'm using my iPad, I'm normally not doing anything else other than reading because I just really like to read when I'm on the plane. I feel like it's my time to kind of let my brain work a little bit. And I also love the game The Room 2. The Room is my favorite game. Like every time I play it, I will replay it because the puzzles are so much fun to complete. There's this puzzle box and you just solve all the different little puzzles on the puzzle box until you open up another layer of the puzzle box and then eventually you find like this great secret. I just really like like those kind of things. I love a good like mystery or like a puzzle game. So it's one of my favorites and it really keeps you occupied on a plane. Next up we have a hair brush. This is the wet brush. Cause when your hair is wet, you would like it to get dry. So you use this, I guess. I don't know. It's just supposed to like not pull out your hair as much. Boring, boring things. Oh, it hit my iPad. <laughs> then I have my camera charger because as you guys know, I have a Canon 70D. Next up, we have an extra set of Bean Boozled Beans, which I have yet to use. Like this video if you think that Nicholas and I should do the Bean Boozled Challenge together. He would have the funniest reactions to this because he does not do well with weird food. Next up, I have my keys attached to a shirt because I'm a mess. I don't even know why this shirt is in here, but it's really cute. This is a shirt from Urban Outfitters. It's apparently been in my backpack. Yay! Then I have my keys, which are so fun. I have a little s'mores. Nicholas has the other little one, so we have like a little twin s'mores thing. I have a little bear that he gave me, and then I have a little utility tactical thing, which has saved my life on so many different occasions. Come at me, robber. I have a pair of dull scissors. Bring it on. I have tens of thousands of pins and a mascara and a brush. Where did that come from? Wow, just discoveries. And then I have just like a billion pins, normally the same pin, which is the B2B pin. It's actually my favorite pin. The last little thing that I have in my backpack, this is the best thing in my backpack. And you know why? It's because Nicholas wrote down a bunch of really, really sweet heartfelt things for our anniversary and they're all in here. It's like all little sweet things that he likes about me or things about our relationship. Though he got me a little moleskin filled with his Poor handwriting, but lovely handwriting because it's all nice, wonderful things about us. It's my favorite thing in the backpack. But that is actually it for what is in my backpack. I know, a lot of random junk is in this bad boy, but man oh man, can it have a good time. Oh, I forgot this front pocket. Let's just do that real quick, ready? Because I know exactly what's in this pocket and you guys are gonna be very excited to find that it is entirely tampons. <laughs> All the tampons in the world are in this front pocket because you never know. You're the savior of womankind if you're the type of person that carries around handfuls of tampons in their backpack. Alrighty guys, so that is it for what is in my backpack. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below what you wanna see next. Do you wanna see a what's in my bag? Do you wanna see another challenge video? What is it? Give me the 411 ladies, I wanna know. Don't forget to like this video once again if you wanna see me and Nicholas do the Bean Boozled Challenge cause that could be fun. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys for the next one. Bye.